Hi everyone, welcome back to the video. In this video, we'll be taking a look at how to reset your Steam account password for 2023 or using the Steam account recovery method. Now, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're updated whenever we upload a new video. Stick until the very end so you don't miss a single detail. Now, go ahead into either the Steam app or even in the browser itself and then click on the login right here. And then you should be able to see something like this. Now, assuming that you know the account name or even the email, but forgot the password, what we can do is we can click on this section right here. It says help. I can't sign in. So let's click on this. Now this will add us into the Steam support. And then we're going to go on this one right here. So I forgot my Steam account name or password. And then we're going to be adding in the email that we have used for this particular account. Now go ahead and verify that you're not a robot. And then let's go ahead and click on search. Now we can get emailed an account verification code to that particular email, or we can go ahead and choose this as well. So if you have that email ready to hand, then we can go ahead and click on this. And then as you can see here, there is an account verification link that was sent to that particular email. So go ahead and check your email. If it is not there after five minutes, then you can click on this resend account verification code. Now go ahead and check into your email and you should see something like this. As you can see here, we can go ahead and click resume recovery. So let's click on this. And then we can go ahead to choose reset the password, reset the email address, or you can get help from a different account. So let's go ahead and reset the password. Now enter in your new password and then click on change password. And there you go. So your password has been updated and now you can go ahead and use that to log in to your account. Well, I hope that you have found this tutorial useful. See you guys next time.